Well, howdy freaking do, guys. What would you even think if I said to you I was doing yet another ad games video? You'd probably be like, this dude is crazy. How could he even do this? Does he hate Arcade 1-Up now? Like, what the hell? How could he just be aligning so tightly with ad games? Well, if you thought that, you'd be ridiculous for thinking that because obviously I love both platforms, but this thing is brand new. It's super exciting to me because it's a tinkerer's heaven because you could do so much with it. But anyways, so what we're going to do today is I'm going to pull this out really quick. I'm not going to say that's what she said because that'd be pretty stupid. But anyways, um, so here we go. So when you're on the at games platform, you're going to notice that there's an area where you can check the versions of your firmware. So right now we're actually on 3.0.1, which is actually a test firmware to fix the issue with the 10 games menu limitation. So as you guys probably know, when you actually put in your USB stick, which you want to do right now, navigate over to the games menu. Oh, I'm gonna buy it. All right, so you're gonna see the add-on there. So when add-on pops up, before in the older firmware, which I believe was 2.0, I can't remember the exact version number now, when you were there, you would put your 10 MAME games here, and unfortunately, that was it. So even if you had 20 games on your USB stick, you were not able to, to navigate over uh, to the right-hand side to see those other games that you had on there. So I've only tested two pages worth of games, but it does, in fact, work. So this will be actual code that they're saying they're going to have out to us uh, later on this week. But I wanted to showcase it now because... Um, I wanted you guys to know that this fix is already coming. So it's pretty cool that they've already, you know, decided to set this up. And it's really cool that they allowed me to sample the firmware. So, oh, cool. Thanks for checking that out the other night with Glenn and, and, cool, and uh, Douglas. That was cool. So anyway, so when I'm on this menu, basically you go all the way over to the right. They didn't fix the idea of being able to move your right joystick over to the next menu. But if I hit C now you'll see I'll actually get the second screen of games. So I've tested, um, I put a bunch of like BS entries in here and I was able to test about 60 something games, but they weren't real games, they were just entries. These games actually work. So I have these all, these are all working, you know, ROMs from a working ROM set. So if I go in here, you'll see it'll load up NBA Jam. I don't actually have the sounds on right now, so let me put that up real quick so you can hear it. But I'm really pumped up that they were fi that they fixed this so quickly. So, um, Let's see, there you go. There's NBA Jam for you. So anyway, so we should see the updated firmware come out shortly. Uh, they said sometime this week, so they didn't guarantee this week, but that's what they're shooting for. Um, so I'm hoping that they actually get them available to us this week. But yeah, all these games are working, so I ha you can have multiple pages of games with no issue, and and you're good to go. So pretty exciting stuff to be able to put. A lot more MAME games on this system than uh, than just Let one one page worth. So, pretty cool stuff. I'm gonna exit out of here really quick. Uh, what I did notice too is oh, there was a t there was a chat in here and I actually missed it. Sorry about that. Um, so if I go right here, hold on, I'm gonna go back one more page so you press b to get back to the other page the first page and you can see you know the games all launch there's certain certain obviously com still no raspberry long version no i still don't have the long version guys i really don't have the time it's going to take a long time to film that those videos you'll notice i haven't done as many mod videos these days i honestly just don't have the time to do them they're really really long and it takes a lot of filming and editing to get those out so i just haven't had a chance to do them I know you guys want it, and trust me, I'd, I'd love to be, be filming all those much longer videos, but I just don't have the time to do it. Actually, I actually haven't tried Street Fighter on this yet. Oh! Oh my gosh, don't don't get beat by Guile. Don't get beat by Guile on the live stream, dude. All right, good. Anyways. <laughs> so 
So guys, uh, you should appear, this should appear um, on your system at some point this week. And like I said, you'll, be, you'll basically go over to settings and you'll go over to the version and you'll check and it'll say the latest version. Obviously right now I'm running, um, you know, early stage beta code that they gave me, but it does in fact fix that main 10 game limitation issue. So pretty damn cool. So expect that to be around sometime this week. I'll actually try to, you know, make that, um, I'll make an announcement when it comes out, but you should see it if you're on your cabinet. But anyways, guys, that's it. That's the only reason why I wanted to post this video. I wanted to get it out at some point over the weekend. But actually, the first version of the code they gave me did not work. So um, so they, they came back and I told them, hey, look, it's not working. And then they, uh, they made the fix really quick and now it's fine. So. so yeah, so you can enjoy all your MAME games. We'd like to see some Killer Instinct. I don't know. I, I actually haven't. I do have a Killer Instinct. Um, rom set i'm not so sure it will work i didn't even try it but um you know this isn't the most powerful local pc on this thing but it's not bad i'd say it's probably i, I haven't actually taken the heat sink off to check it but I, I don't think it'd probably be powerful enough to run ki uh, although the system itself can run the new version of ki over steam if that's something you're interested in so all right, guys, well, hopefully the next update they give us is local Steam so we don't have to pay the dollar an hour, so that'd be pretty cool. But as of right now, they haven't provided any code to show, off, show that function off yet. But that's it, guys. If you enjoyed this video, um, please like it. Please consider subscribing to the channel. And uh, as always, guys, thanks for joining, and I will see you on the next one. Take care.